All right, this is a video to tell if you have a bad heating element. So at first, you're gonna set your amp meter, if you have an amp meter, set it to the highest setting. And then you're gonna put it on this wire here. And notice that it's zero, if you can see that. All right, turn, uh, turn the faucet on hot, just one. And this is gonna be your first element. Let's see how you're getting a reading of about 30, 33 amps. And then put it on the second one. You're getting a low amp draw, about 18. And then that last one, it's showing almost nothing. So, it works in stages, so you're going to have one and two turn on to, to bring heat. Then that last one's kind of like a booster one, and it's going to look for more amp draw. All right, turn another. Okay, so. So that's the second faucet we have on. So now you're seeing that one jump on, because that's kicking in depending on how the flow meter is reading. So you got... About 32 amps on our first stage. You got about 32 amps on the second stage. And then you have about 16 or so on that other stage. And like I said, that'll kick up to 30 if you're using, you know, like a sink and a shower at the same time or two showers at the same time. But if you had an element that was reading zero, that'd mean that element and that unit would be bad. And on this unit, there's three of them. So, hope that helps. Thanks for watching.